Hello, I present today the Advanced Editor Tools plugin, previously known as TinyMCE Advanced, that allow to increase the number of formatting tools such as tables, emoticons, and custom font families, that are available and gives you more control of which tools are included on the visual editor. Before benefiting from the features of the Advanced Editor Tools plugin, you must first install and activate it. So, log into your WordPress dashboard, then navigate to Plugins, select Add New. In the search box, type Advanced Editor Tools, click Install, and finally click Activate. After installation, you first configure your Advanced Editor Tools in Settings. So, select Advanced Editor Tools. How you configure depends on if you are using the Block Editor or the Classic Editor. In fact, once you've activated the Advanced Editor Tools plugin in Plugins, it automatically replaces the default WordPress Visual Editor with the Advanced Editor Tools, which looks like this in the Block Editor, and also adds a Classic Paragraph Block. Now, I will explain how configure the advanced editor tools if you are using the block editor. Concerning the toolbars for the block editor. The advanced editor tools automatically adds clear formatting and mark to the drop down menu on the paragraph blocks toolbar, and moves subscript, superscript, and text color from the drop down menu in the toolbar to the block settings in the editor sidebar, and adds an underline option. You drag and drop the options between the main toolbar's drop-down menu and the alternative side toolbar to change, and reorder which items appear in the paragraph block toolbar drop-down menu and block settings in the editor sidebar. Remember to click save changes each time you make a change. For any item you want removed from the paragraph blocks toolbar and block settings in the editor sidebar, you drag and drop into the unused buttons for blocks toolbar area. The two options, Enable setting of selected text color and enable setting of selected text background color, can be changed to no as the latest version of WordPress already includes these options. The classic block looks like the classic editor but it is in block form and is narrower than the classic editor. For best results enable the editor menu and only add essential items to the toolbar. Here's what the classic block looks like when the advanced editor tools plugin is activated. You remove buttons from the toolbar by dragging the buttons from the toolbar, and dropping them into the unused button area. You add buttons by dragging the buttons from the unused button area to the toolbar. You can see here that, list style options extend your bulleted and numbered list options. Clicking on the drop down arrow next to the bulleted list icon, or numbered list icon reveals the extra options, for example extra bulleted list options, extra numbered list options, context menu, alternative link dialog and advanced options. Under advanced options, you can replace the paragraph block with the classic paragraph block by selecting make the classic paragraph or classic block the default block. Now, let's see the classic editor. By default, the editor menu is enabled. For best results it is recommended to keep the editor menu enabled. You can remove buttons from the toolbars by dragging the buttons from the toolbar, and dropping them into the unused button area. You add buttons by dragging the buttons from the unused button area to the desired toolbar. Any button used regularly would be added to the first toolbar row. Remember to click save changes each time you make a change. You can see here that, List style options extend your bulleted and numbered list options. Clicking on the drop down arrow next to the bulleted list icon, or numbered list icon reveals the extra options, for example extra bulleted list options, extra numbered list options, context menu, alternative link dialog and advanced options. There is no need to make any changes to the advanced options. I finished here the video, if you find it useful, subscribe for more video. Thanks and see you soon in the next videos.